Well, previously we managed to find both of the fast travel points on this island, which is the island where I started, I should mention. Of course, this brings up a bunch of other questions, but I guess what matters here is that I might as well just clear off this island. But in the meantime, I could find some more fast travel points. In fact, what's this right here? Actually, there are no more fast travel points here. It's just undiscovered locations. And let's see, we got a blacksmith, a ship dock, a message board. I guess I can go there. Let's see what we can do. On a related note, the game mentioned in one of the hints. Too bad. I mean, if there's a way for me to see the hints, I don't know what they are. But they said if you uh, unequip your weapon from the inventory here, you can knock enemies out instead of killing them. So I'm curious how this will work. So I unequipped Cassandra right here. That's her name, Cassandra, right? And I unequipped her, so I've decided to, okay, let's do this thing. Uh, so we're going to knock enemies out if we get into fights with them, which is fine by me. I don't need to kill them. I just need to, get, I just need to avoid them. I have a horse, Phobos, who I believe climbs the mountains. Like a goat, I believe was the reference. Uh, okay, Xena. Where's our map? A. Hmm. We're going down here anyway. Yep. So we're going east. There's no, yeah, there is a, you can barely see that compass. You can barely see that compass at point east. Uh, waypoint is over there. That's the bandit camp, but I'm going down there. Oh, yeah, where's my, uh, yeah, that's right. I was supposed to get to the, uh, leap of faith. Right down there, right in the grass. And try this at home, kids. And in case you were wondering, she's wearing underwear. <laughs> Rise her up here, boys. Uh, let's see. Then we'll, we aren't going to talk about, you know, statues getting... We are not We are not going to talk about statues getting censored. This is not the kind of channel for that kind of nonsense. Maybe other times, but not this time. I would... I, by the way, I'm not going to blame Japan for this. <laughs> Ubisoft did that. <laughs> so you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Can't always blame Japan for this kind of stuff. Let's see. That, 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 I'm sure... What's, I'm sure what's his name, Leonidas, was actually <laughs> wearing, walking around with a loincloth too, wasn't he? Uh, let's see. Uh, well, I made it. So what do I get for my trouble? Temple of Zeus. Wait, not here. Just a second. Here we go. Or is answered. Yeah. <laughs> Somewhat cocky, aren't we, Cassandra? I'll find it. Uh, what is it, by the way? Also, a likely story. That's all for now. 
Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure they're trying to hire Gal Gadot for the uh, Xena for the Xena film, I guess. Well, let's see how we see how this works. Hey, I'm close to my target. Press up to call Icarus. Icarus. Which target? Track? Okay. Yeah, stationary mode. So we've already established that. And there I am. That's the Marts Marcos. Uh, it's, what's down there? I'll set a marker over there. Up. Yep, back to me. Okay, where are we at? So head over there later. Let me head over here. And what else am I missing? It's over here. And yeah, what's all this? What's the bulletin board? Mercenary work. Wolf first. And I can do that. Level two. Well, I'm level one, but I should be able I should be fine. I'm also playing on the hard difficulty levels, I recall. Uh where was the there was a something or rather around here. It's listed. Yeah, options. Yeah, that's where it's listed. Options. I pressed left on the D-pad for that, by the way. No HDR, of course, because we're on a regular Xbox. Yep, hard difficulty. Uh, game mode. Exploration allows you to discover more of the world by yourself, while the guided mode will take you through each step. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. I'm fine. Uh, I can turn off the blood if I want. Aim assistance. Partial assistance, partial. So, snap to targeting, I guess. Auto aim, you know how it is. Uh, left on the D pad. Save. Uh, I did a manual save and a manual save, yeah. We'll overwrite that, we're fine. Hold down the A button to confirm. So, again, this is the thing that No Man's Sky is doing where it's like, yeah, they're doing games where you're using the. You're using this big old circular cursor here and you just hold the button down to confirm choices. I, this is okay, I guess. I'm curious. Because I'm, I'm looking back at games like, you know... I'm looking back at games like Just Cause 2 and they're not doing anything like this. So I guess it's a new best practices for games that are PC and uh, console friendly, I suppose. I'm not going to steal. Well, not yet. Uh, where are we headed? Yeah, I already went to the bulletin board. Okay, so... Uh, sorry, press... Press B to crouch in the middle of the street where everyone can see you. <laughs> That's like as big as at all. Uh, let's see. Uh, Sammy. Nothing else here to see, right? Y'all visit those undiscovered locations later. Uh, up up on the right stick. Uh, Sammy. Blacksmith. We'll see what's going on with the blacksmith. Best kind of smith. And I go into the bulletin board, so let's hop. It says west, right? Probably should have paid attention to where the icons were on the map. Just a second, I'm all lost again. If there's a quick button for the map, I don't know what it is. I'll fucking figure it out. Okay, uh, Icarus, get over here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, there's the port. So we have that. Set a marker over there. Is that a soldier? Up. Oh. We'll see what that soldier wants. I can punch him in the face. We can pick a fight. We'll be fine. I can sneak up on him. That might be a good idea. Hey, you. Let's fight. Uh, um. Stealth attack. Uh, 
That didn't work. I thought I, I thought I thought I turned my thought I turned my weapon off. There we go. Press the right trigger. Ow. Don't have, probably should have a shield at least. So the stealth attack worked. Whoops. Died. Maybe I do need a sword. <laughs> yep, let's reload the latest game save. So I picked a fight with a guy I didn't need to fight. I mean, why did I do that? Just because. <laughs> it's a video game. Might as well practice. See what I can do. So maybe I should have brought my sword, then de-equipped it, maybe. I was just curious if... Uh... So basically, stealth killing somebody... St the stealth attack meant I pulled out my knife to severely weaken him, but... <laughs> didn't actually kill him. So that's a problem. Yeah, assassination. What kind of game you think this is? Okay, so we'll go over here. Greco Roman wrestling? Yeah, blacksmith. And yeah, can I sell anything? Probably not. Well, I could sell my sword, but I kind of want to keep it for handy. I want to keep it for uh, fights that I actually have to win. Torso. Don't want to sell that. Sell all trade goods? Yeah, the trade goods. Yeah, it's good for nothing. I have seven gold, so whatever. What can I buy? Heavy blunt. Wait, shouldn't there be, like, armor or something? Yeah, there they are. Required level. Hey, Icarus. Uh, cost 80 gold. Jeez, these guys are killing me with this. Cars 150 gold. Yeah, we're done. Bye. Stay black. I, um... Hmm. Gosh darn it. Uh, left trigger. Went to the bulletin board already. And go to Sammy in a second. Is someone else over here? What's flaw over there? Boost with the right trigger. So I can I can do my exploring this way. Why not? Eh. Uh, hmm. Okay, left trigger. We have to get closer. I can go down, right? That's as far that's as far down as I can go. Huh. Yeah, because I figured there'd be more here that I can see. Whoop, here we go. There's something over here. That's something. Okay, so I can explore that area over there. So there is something here I could actually uh, tag. That's good to know. Uh, hmm. See what's over there. Everything else is too far away, I guess. <laughs> if you want to tag a boat, you can. Tag the water if you want. Well, it's an open world game, so it's open world already. 2.30, how far away am I from that target? Go up a bit. Okay, there's a target over there. What am I looking for over there? Hold up on the D-pad to go down, which can't go down that much.
Yeah, what's that? Soldiers and a workbench. Okay. So these are weaker soldiers, so it might be worth exploring that area. Grind up, why not? And that is a target, I guess. That's a target, I guess. But, found that. Okay, go up and around. Alright. Uh, there's also a waypoint over there I can explore. Anything over here? Just goats. I think I already got that. I can fast travel there. Good. I can fast travel from, e from Eagle form. That's pretty cool. I was expecting that kind of versatility. I probably should watch uh, Tom Chick's videos over at quarter to three on his channel. His YouTube, his YouTube channel. Because I'll be able to see how he gets around. See if he finds a faster way to get around that I'm not aware of. Uh, let's circle over there. Let's circle back around to the right. Away from the coast here, away from the harbor. The level four, yeah, we do not want to be here. The level four soldiers. So basically, don't come here. We'll circle back around in a second. Let's see what that place is. We probably can't mess around with this area. The enemies here are too strong. Davos. Ended up at a conference of rich people, I guess. All the rich economists, right? And uh, these guys, yeah. Yep, look at that. Another treasure chest. Okay, let's circle back around. There was uh, something here to the right. Is that it? A bunch of stuff over there I must have missed. Let's circle back around over here, see what's going on. All in time. We'll see what all this crap is. There. Let's get a bit closer. Very scenic. This island alone would be half of a Far Cry 3 game, I think. Not a bad layout. Uh, sharks? I can dive bomb. I can't go any lower. Nope, can't go any lower. There is a treasure chest. And a level 3 shark. Maybe we can punch it in the nose like Lara Croft did. 350... Uh, 304. Let's see what that's about. So I can't, I can't dive any lower. That's cute. Well, it increases the draw distance, but it decreases the uh, amount of detail I can put on these maps, which I think is kind of amusing. <laughs> There it is. Level one dude with a treasure chest. Alright. Over here. I guess this is still a research stream, isn't it? 190. 40, so we'll go this way. Very curious to see what's over here. 174. Okay, we're getting pretty close. Down there. Another treasure chest. Now, is there anything good in here is the question. That's going to be a very interesting question. Up there. Tag it. Let's get a bit higher. Okay, what's going on down here? Got more wolves. They got loot. Over here. The wolves are digging over. A hmm. Over here? We've already established this. Anything else? I think we're good. I just wanted to see what else is around here. 
27, 300. It will go over here and end of it. Well, will go over here and go back to where I was. The bird doesn't get tired. I'm not complaining. Over there. Wait, did I miss something? Did I miss? Yeah, there, it's over here. I thought it was over here. There it is, over there, down there, where that lake is. Well, got a treasure chest. All right, press up and go back to where we were. So I got to do some more exports to kind of see what's on this map. So if I want to tag a different location, I can. But obviously, you know, load times being what they are because of all the restrictions we have to deal with. Oh, well. Given we even just cause had to worry about loading stuff. <laughs> yes, it's pretty bad. <laughs> Probably should have done that. <laughs> That's okay. It's not as bad as playing Shadow of Mordor on the on the 360, but it's pretty bad. All right, uh, Sammy blacksmith. So we'll go to Sammy. We'll go to the dock first, maybe. How how much closer can we get? Can't get any closer. Okay, fine. Where's the dock? Wait, well, obviously, docks where the water is. <laughs> Excuse me. It's like, duh, this is the dock. But, up. Uh, it's too far away. There's a treasure chest right there. I'll take that. No load times. <laughs> well, very short load times, very reasonable ones. Okay. Where they at? Ha! Give me the loot. That's stealing crap. <laughs> I was trying to get treasure chests that wouldn't be counted as stealing. Yeah, well. I tried. There's supposed to be one other point. <coughs> yeah, we're Sammy. Well, this is Sammy, actually. Up. No, up. Okay, so I press the Windows button. Yeah, this is Sammy. Yeah, this is Sammy. Ship dock, blacksmith. Get the spear when I'm level two. But in the meantime, Undiscovered locations. Okay, so what's the first order of business here? Because there's no. Well, I, I didn't. Bring, where's my horse? I had a horse. We used to bandit camp when I'm level two. We'll get to that. So let me peek at this area over here. I'll bring out my horse in a second. Let me get a Icarus over there. See what's going on. Uh, not there. Am I missing something here? There it is. All right, let's mark this thing. I'm just curious what enemies are in the area, because they're level one, I can deal with that. Down here. Treasure chest? Nope. Bit lower. There is a treasure chest, but no enemies. Well, not complaining. Might be a soldier guarding the place, but yeah, no enemies. Or I could sneak over there. Up. <laughs> so we'll do a quick load. Well, maybe not a quick one. Maybe about ten seconds. <laughs> So I'll make my way over there and see what's up. See what I can get for my trouble. Okay, there's a bunch of commotion going on. What's happening here? 
Yeah, the wrestling. So I'm not going in there because that's stealing. There might be a treasure chest here that's going to be considered stealing too, but at least I'll unfog an area of the map. Okay, let's get my save point on. Main menu. I can do my quick save. Quick saves are fine. All right, see what I can do here. It's an open world game. Let's open world some. See what we can do that's worth doing early in the game. If I, if I want to play with a purpose, I'll do that later. But for now, I'm just not messing around. See, I like how the lighting goes from dark to light as soon as you go through the door. I do like that. Nice little touch. I, don't, I think Far Cry 4... I think Far Cry 5 does that. I'm trying to remember. It's been a while. But a few other games are doing that, and it's a really good effect, I think. Found the abandoned house. Up. Got to press A to jump. Yeah, let's do some Assassin's Creeding. <laughs> some parkour. Give me the loot. Drachma. And now I have, a, and now I have eight Drachma. Actually, I think, I'm, I think I'm up to nine now. Yay. I'm not going to carry that. Up. Hold down the L button. Yes, there's one location objective to clear this area. I saw it here somewhere. Where the heck is it? Maybe it's inside the building. Icarus. There it is, inside the building. Up. I'll take that. Thanks. Uh, yeah, let's. This isn't stealing. It's not red. Here we go. Fresh fish. Wow, now we got some drachma. Yep. Objective completed. And I get the experience. So this is how I go up experience levels. Not through combat, but by stealing stuff from random people. <laughs> Looting abandoned houses. That's how I'm going to earn my experience. Experienced thief, street rat. Rascal, street rat, scoundrel. Ah, wait, wait, wait. Not that. We're fine. We gotta use knife. Is it a good knife or like a butter knife? Well, let's find out. Yeah, what do I got here? Yeah, it's just a. It's a butter knife. Browse bag. Trade goods. Yep. It's a butter knife. <laughs> Some of this is worth money. Fresh fish in the abandoned house. Well, I stole it good I stole it all the same. Okay, uh, where are we going next? Just a second. Go the map. Press the wrong button. I'm supposed to press the Windows button to get to that map. Okay, that's where I am, Icarus. It's my golden eagle. Yes, I'm the yellow triangle, and Icarus is that eagle. Okay, uh, what's over here? Level 2. Probably don't want to mess with that. Deck Collector is level 2. Uh, Kleptus Bay. Yeah, there's some high level enemies there, as I recall. Level 5 stuff. So, where are the level 1 enemies I saw around here? Yeah, I want to say there are some level 1 enemies around here. Well, let's track that. Icarus, get over there. Let me see what's going on over there. Yeah, that's it, right? Level 1 enemies. Yeah, level 1 enemies. We can deal with these guys. Okay, so we'll go over here. This will be our next video. Up. Probably should have gone to the map, though, but that's where I know I'm going. So we'll make this our cliffhanger. See, so we, we know how to have fun in these Assassin's Creed games, don't we? This seems, to be more, this seems to be more fun than all the other Assassin's Creed games I was forced to play. So I'm willing to deal with this. Okay, I've already done that. So, 
clear that area out. So basically, I'm going over here. Yeah, it's just a bunch of level one guys. I'm not even worried. Well, it's over there, so let's see how quickly I can get over there. Let's see how, see how long it takes to get 200 meters. Shouldn't be a serious problem, I don't think. So what else is on the agenda? See, I got this game. I got... Uh, yeah, Divinity. Yeah, Divinity is Original Sin 2. And uh, I gotta play Pandora's Tower, actually. So I gotta watch a couple... I gotta watch another video of it. So I wanna see if I can ma do about four more hours of that game, if I can help it. Because I'm very curious to know how that game plays out, because I'm running out of renewal. So I haven't played it in three months. So I admit I'm that guy. <laughs> Quick save? Quick save. Yeah, we're fine. And we'll do a hard save here. Uh, not that save. Main menu, and we'll do a hard save. Because we have a ground zero save already. So I don't mind doing this. I also have this game on the uh, X, on the uh, PS4 from the library as well. I just lucked out, so if I have to take this one back, I can just get the P I can play the PS4 version instead. I'll probably mess around with it later. Oh wait, here we go. It's on now. Crouch to become less visible and hide in the vegetation. See? And press the Y button to assassinate in an Assassin's Creed game. Give me the loot. Okay, press right on the D-pad. Up. No, down. Up. You gotta get my weapon out. Down. Left. Right. Nah, I can't do that. Okay, I'll do it the old-fashioned way. There's another way to do it. There's another way to equip. I just don't know what it is. Uh, let's see. So we gotta. I gotta kill these guys. Too bad, really. There's a non-violent way to do it. I'll do it later. So they have both of their backs turned to me. What could possibly go wrong? Why? And you got your back turned to me as well. Great patrolling, guys. Kill three enemies without being detected or hit. One more guy here? Nah, I carry him. And you. You're going down too, lady. Sorry. <laughs> you're all in it together. Untie me now. Untie me. Let me go. Give us free. This frame rate is not good, obviously. Like, it's everything, like, really choppy. <laughs> so it kind of hurts the animation a bit. That's kind of annoying. Well, they're rendering everything in engine, so that's the price you pay sometimes. <laughs> why cut back on the detail if you're... Why cut back on the detail when you can have, you know... I guess... Having really crappy motion is nothing compared to seeing that incredible detail, right? Uh -huh. Okay. 
Kate Leonidas. You're gonna make the you're gonna make the kid kill a boar too. Oh, this is Cassandra's flashback. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> to be fair, Assassin's Creed 3 didn't have a bad story from what I saw. <laughs> but it, you know. Obvious anachronisms. I'm hunted. Bounty hunters are hostile mercenaries who will hunt you down as long as you have a bounty. That's usually to be paid off. The Cyclops want to set payoffs. Press the hamburger button for the mercenaries menu. Uh, was <laughs> is this like a Shadow of Mordor? What do you got going on here? Your position, the rewards for each tier, as well as the status, strength, and weaknesses for all no mercenaries and bounty hunters. You should avoid them until you level up and become strong enough to fight them, okay? That's cute. He's level 5. Let's not mess with him. Continue. Yeah, we're doing Shadow, Shadow of Mordor, apparently. It's a nice wrinkle, though. I like that. Seems interesting. We'll see how that goes. Uh, let's see. Uh, of course, the whole joke with Shadow of Mordor is that was a better Assassin's Creed game than Assassin's Creed was. I guess as far as the combat goes. So I got the treasure. I guess she was the treasure. Nothing else to see here, huh? Yes, yeah, not a place worth discovering. Okay. Uh, hmm. So where do I go from here? I'm going to have to end the video at some point. Yeah, that is a place I can visit in a second. This is a graveyard. Any other points I'm missing here? Yeah, level five stuff. Okay. Uh, hmm. Well, let's see what's over there. First things first. Uh, quick save. Can't quick save here. Okay, uh, up for the bird. I think I can track back west. Yeah, can't fight him yet. We'll worry about him later. Choir wolf first. 
We should have plenty of these, actually. Track that one. Let's get back to the bird. Of course, I haven't seen any wolves. I mean, there are some wolves wandering around one of these temples or whatever it is. This might be it right here. Let's do a, take a quick look. I could call Phobos the horse. We'll get to that. All right. Wait, where is this? There's a soldier somewhere around here. Yeah, he's guarding the place. Okay. I understand. We'll get to here. Never mind. Down. Down. Up. Hold down to call Phobos. Phobos. 